Welcome back, anime fans. Today, we're diving deep into the twisted mind of Tanya de Gyurcha from Saga of Tanya the Evil. Prepare yourselves for a roller coaster of diabolical deeds and a few laughs along the way. Let's figure out why Tanya is one of the most evil characters in anime history. So, who is Tanya de Gyurchaf? On the surface, she's a cute, blonde haired, blue eyed girl. But don't let that fool you. She's actually a reincarnated salaryman from Japan who got on the wrong side of a godlike being known as being X. Imagine being reborn in a war torn world because you ticked off a deity. Talk about holding a grudge. If you thought your Monday was bad, try being forced into eternal combat because you didn't say your prayers. Classic God Complex, am I right? Tanya's evil shines brightest in her ruthless efficiency. She's a military prodigy who aims for nothing short of total annihilation of her enemies. Her motto might as well be why solve with diplomacy what you can obliterate with artillery? Imagine her in a corporate job. Need to increase productivity? Easy. Fire half the staff and make the rest work double. Problem solved. What makes Tanya truly terrifying is her cold, calculated approach. She treats war like a business, focusing solely on efficiency. If she were your boss, the company would hit all its targets, morale, sanity, and safety be damned. She's like a human calculator, but one that's more likely to calculate your demise than your taxes. Tanya's feud with being X is another layer of her evil. She's on a mission to prove she doesn't need divine help to succeed. It's like she's trying to get through life without coffee just to make a point except replace coffee with divine intervention and life with a brutal war. It's the ultimate, you're not my real dad. Moment. If defiance was an Olympic sport, Tanya would have all the gold medals. Now, let's not ignore the comedic gold, Tanya's appearance versus her actions. Watching a tiny girl give military orders is like watching a toddler try to run a board meeting. Where's my juice box? and bring me the battle plans. Picture this, do your homework, Tanya. Sorry, I'm too busy conquering nations. In conclusion, Tanya de Gyurchaf is a masterclass in anime villainy. Her intelligence, ruthlessness, and bizarre reincarnation story make her one of the most evil characters we've seen. Love her or hate her, you can't deny that Tanya leaves a lasting impression. Thanks for joining us on this deep dive into the mind of Tanya the Evil. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment on who you think is the most evil anime character. And remember, if Tanya de Gyurchaf asks you to do something, just do it. Trust me, it's safer that way.